And um, as for other pieces of data, we have um, some kind of different and interesting event in the United Kingdom. It is the release of British Autumn Statement. Um, what is this event about? It means that British Chancellor of or to put it more simply, finance minister, will um, deliver the information about uh, how, um, about the British budget and the state of the nation's finance. Um, it is an event which happens every year and probably Philip Hammond, who is the British Finance Minister, will have to admit the largest deterioration in British public finance since 2011. Uh, and uh, of course this um, piece of news may affect British pound, it is an event risk for British pound. Uh, as the information about this event was published in Financial Times, the market didn't react much to the news that um, the report will be uh, negative. So um, probably we'll have, we won't have a great impact on the currency, but still, it um, should be far from positive. Also, if we look at the data in Great Britain, which were released during the past week, uh, we should say that Mark Carney, the governor of the Bank of England, is in his testimony, has said that he expects the inflation rate to rise despite the weak report on the latest annual uh, consumer price index and as a result if we speak about British pound we uh, don't think that the Bank of England will uh, resource to easing measures in the near-term future. This um, is a factor which supports the British pound.